Where's Mama? Where's Mama? She's getting some snacks. Where'd she go? There's a chicken. You don't get out in the real world very often. Is your, is your leash okay? Huh? How's your necklace? Oh, there's a dog you don't like. Mama's getting some snacks at the Sorry Sorry store. Who's with you? I, I, brought, I brought my son. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. See, Daddy don't know how to drive now. Who's that? Who's that boy? Yeah, girls. Daddy, oh. Hi, see Daddy, oh. Scary. <laughs> That's a water. Two two big swimming pool. Yeah. It. Kev. Still. <laughs> you never saw so much water? <laughs> where do you think you get your little fish? <laughs> That's where your fish comes from. <laughs> okay, Kevin, time to go scuba diving. You have to go hang out with your day. Oh, you're not done? Found something stinky? Kev! Hi! He thought the ocean was scary until I told him that's where he gets the fish. Oi! So, Kevin saw the ocean for the first time, then he saw a chicken for the first time, didn't know what to do. And now it's getting dark, I'm gonna go to the ocean and find some critters for the first time for you guys. So... Oh. Uh, wait. Oh. Yeah, that's better. Let's go find the critters, see what's out there tonight. This frogfish is so tiny and I know a lot of you guys always ask me how tiny they are. So I put the golf ball down next to it and there you can see some comparison. It's just so hard to find. Well, I also found this little crab. I'm not sure what species it's called, maybe a porcelain crab, but they're hanging out on sea pins that you really only see at night. And this guy was a hard one to find. I've been looking for a while. And they're not just hard to find. They usually don't cooperate either. But this guy was just a perfect situation. He sat at the top of the sea pin where it was easy to film. And he was just kind of catching sediment. As you can see there with his little catcher mitts. <laughs> well, fans, whatever you call those things. He was just catching sediment out of the water. It was such a great find. This was, of course, another awesome dive. We're so spoiled here in Darwin. I see countless species that I haven't even filmed. So if you guys want a trip like this, I have one planned in November to Porta Galera. So I'm going to put the email down below. You can email and get some information and join me in November in Porta Galera for the ultimate seven day critter trip. So thank you guys for watching.
I'll see you on the next one.